Congratulations. Wow. How was it? Thank you. Um, difficult as always, um, but um, I'm excited. Um, I think my performance, I probably will be here and everything went up to plan. But what was the time? 8.51. Wow. So 8.51. Wow. And tell us, what was the biggest challenge on the road? Funny enough, uh, today, I, I thought I wasn't going to have a challenge, but I thought that's too good to be true. Yeah. Um, I'd say at, at some point I felt like I was getting cramps and it was still too early. I, I remember literally saying, God, please don't do it, mm -hmm. not today. Um, so that difficult part for me was just managing the, 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 my mental um, um, strength in mm -hmm. terms of being able to move past that because I was getting worried that I'm not going to finish mm -hmm. this if I'm hearing the cramp at 30. So, yeah, and I remember the first words I said, God, not today. Not today, right. Yeah. But what kept you going? Look, I think it's the cause first, um, the initiative and the work that we've put in, in, in helping an African student mm -hmm. and, and a learner. So that kept me going because I've always said it's not about me this time. It's about giving back and, and creating an impact for our community. So at each kilometer I ran, I felt like the puzzle is, 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 is fitting. And whatever we've been planning with, with the Tutuba team and the Saika team mm, just mm, felt mm. perfect today. I couldn't fault it. It's exciting. Mm. And any support that you got on the road? Ah, Tutuba again. <laughs> amazing. Amazing. Uh, just to share, um, I think Daka like said the highlight for me was just in Westville as I entered the town. Mm -hmm. And I met a group of Tutuba students that literally swarmed into the road and, and chanting and were so happy. So, and it's funny that even two of the students literally ran me up the hill and that I think the 851 time, I, I, I commend them, I really, they were part of it. Mm. Tell us, first thoughts as you cross the finish line. Look, the, the, the first thought when I crossed the finish line, one, I couldn't believe the time. Um, people kept saying, we're going to do a sub nine. A sub nine means we're going to do it below nine hours. So that's the first thought, the joy when I saw the time. And secondly, for me, it was about, wow, we've done it. Mm -hmm. And the thought was never, I've done it. But the thought is, we've done it. And the first thing when I crossed the line, I'm like, I need to talk to, to my Tutuba team. Mm -hmm. I need to tell them about the, yeah. the experiences I had. Yeah. So those are my two thoughts, um, actually. Oh, good. And tell us, for people that would like to support the cause, the Tutuba cause, how do they go about it? So before I get there, I'd just like to, to express um, um, gratitude and a token of, of, of um, appreciation to everyone that has supported us this far through their donations. We appreciate it immensely and it means a lot for us as, as the Tutuba team. And like I said in my original video, that is, this is the first installment of fundraising activities we're doing. So kudos to this one, um, to the Tutuba team, to Saika, everyone, uh, brilliant. So for me, it's, 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 it's really about that. We appreciate it, guys, and let's keep doing this and take it to new heights. Um, without you, we couldn't have done it. And actually, you asked me when I crossed the line, I think the third thing was I can't let the people that have donated mm -hmm. to the post down. Mm -hmm. So every kilometer as I was going through, I'm like, they watching. Mm -hmm. I have to do best for them. Mm -hmm. um, so yes, you can still, I think the, 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 the donation link is still accessible um, on Backup Body. You do see the post on LinkedIn. I'll post them at the, the tutorial team on our Instagram. Mm -hmm. We leave it open for maybe two, three days after today and we will close it out and look this next day we're looking at other fundraising activities but just be on the lookout. There are so many CAs that were part of the conference marathon. What would be your message to those CAs that we're running today? Actually quite right. Um, last week I was actually speaking to one of the members and they were asking me to, to join the cause and I think we're at an advanced stage of the planning and preparation. So I said to them we're going to go back and sit around the table, but the plan is to bring each and every scene. So my message to them is, we, we need to make this, this big. We've, we've started the blueprint. 
we, we still want suggestions on how we can make it better um, and also promote the, the social aspect of the profession um, but also helping uh, or lending rather a helping hand through fundraising activities. So I'm calling upon all our seniors um, that are members with SAIGA to sit with us across the table and participate in our fundraising activities. Look, we just started with running. There's, there's great plans coming along. We're looking at different sports codes, not only running. So the message to the members, we're not only pleading to runners. It could be a tennis tournament, it could be netball. It, we, we're diverse, we're not, we're not discriminating against any sport, but we want the, the, the social aspect whilst also achieving the fundraising um, objectives of, of, of Tutuba. I see you got two medals. Tell us about the medals. Exciting times. Um, so yes, um, the reason I've got two, as I did my comrades back to back, the first one was last year. So this first medal, you see there's two people running. Mm -hmm. That's what I've earned for doing it in two consecutive years. Mm -hmm. And the cherry on top is this one, mm -hmm. the real piece of medal. Mm -hmm. um, they call it a bill roll. Mm -hmm. We call it a billy yes. um, in running uh, terminology. You get this one, it's very really close to my heart. You get this one for completing the Comrades Marathon below nine hours. So wow. that was my plan originally. Mm -hmm. It did happen and thanks to the good Lord. But yeah, my most prized possession as of today, the whole year until the next conference. Yes. Well done, Pop. Thank you so much.